Hi and uh, welcome to lesson 18 or tutorial 18. So today what we have here on the screen is a hybrid mesh but also it has got multiple cell zones. So let me just uh, open Um, so what we have is multiple cells on hybrid mesh. Now today we are going to discuss or yeah discuss how to convert uh, a mesh that's made in ICM CFT with more than one cell zone. So multiple cell zone mesh in fluent mesh format which is dot msh this one to open from uh, mesh so this is particularly useful for dynamic meshing or moving grid. Okay, so um, we have uh, this pink or purple zone is called fluid outer, so it's the outer fluid, and the blue one is called uh, fluid, which will, which will be the one which will be rotating. So this will be stationary and this will be moving and this interface 2 and interface 2 will be the, the interface between the two cell zones. So the normal method, um, I'm using open form in Windows, um, so I'm using a SciGreen based compiler. So I have placed, uh, converted that mesh uh, from into fluent format so this mesh into fluent format using output write input and then i converted it into a fluent msh file so it's called fluent merged dot mesh merged spelling is wrong so fluent merged yeah so now it's in the open form test directory so I, it's, it's the case directory, so which I have the initial conditions, the mesh details, and the numerical setup. And this is the mesh file. So in bash, I'm, I am, I am in that folder, C drive, applied CFD open form, test grid. So the same folder is here. Now, if the normal method, if you don't have multiple cell, cell zones, is just to write fluent mesh dot form mesh to form dot exe and then just write the name of the mesh so fluent merge dot mesh so that's been converted into open form format now if I click mesh I have cylinder far field default wall and uh, so the two zones are not being identified so the the if you don't have multiple zones then you can use fluent mesh to form and then you write the name of the mesh name dot message but if you have multiple cell zones And what you do is you write fluent mesh to form uh, the name of the mesh in this case it's fluent merged dot msh and then you write minus write sets so we are asking you to write the sets face sets so here now we see here uh, fluid and fluid outer uh, so the command was fluent mesh to form um, 
and of the mesh dot msh and minus info w white cells and after that you want to convert it into a cell zone so what you do is you write set to zones minus no flip map and now it's been returned to cell zones adding set as a face zone adding a set as a face zone where there's a cells fluid volume it's added as a cell zone so it's been done and uh, the command was um, click what was it even I am forget set to zones minus no flip map sets to zone minus no flip map make sure that the uh, capital letters are capital and symbol ones are simple so this will identify if you check the mesh now check mesh you have uh, two cell zones uh, cell zones two writing region zero as region zero and so now you've got two cell zones which then you can use in in the to control so one cell zone is called fluid which is the which is the inner fluid and then the other one is called fluid outer which is the outer cell zone so this is the way to do this uh, all right thank you